All right. Now we're doing free code camp, JavaScript algorithms and data structures beta. Learn basic string and array methods by building a music player. Step 15. All right. So now we're going to create a button element with class playlist song info. Inside the button, we're going to add a span element with the class playlist song title. Then we're going to interpolate song.title as the text. All right. So basically first we're going to make this button thing. So like as we can see now we're inside of this list item right here, right? So we're going to let's we'll highlight this stuff and let's press enter and we can see the button is way over here. We'll say button like this, close button, and there we go. All right, so for the button, what we're gonna do is give it the class playlist song info. So we're gonna say class equals playlist, whoa, whoa, whoa. playlist hyphen song hyphen info, like that. And then inside this button, we're gonna put some span elements, or we're gonna put a span element. All right, so we'll put, uh, we'll open up a span and close the span. And inside of here, we're gonna give it the class playlist song title, right? So we'll say class equals, and then we'll do playlist, hyphen, song, hyphen, title, all right? And inside of the span, we're gonna give it the text of the uh, embedded expression. So we'll do dollar sign, curly braces, and we're gonna do song dot title, all right? So basically what this is doing is it's making this button right here, all right? Which is inside the list item. This is, a, this is all a list, right? Each one of these is a list item, and each one of these is a button, and each one of these buttons has a span that has song.title inside of it, and that's what can't stay down is, and this one here and this one here, right? So that's how that's working right now. Uh, so basically, when we uh, check the code, looks good, and submit it. All right. Now we're on to step 16, and we'll see you next time.